and welcome back to my channel and if you are new then a big huge welcome to you and the car just drove past <laughs> blimey well long time no see and um some many of you have been wondering where i have been for the past month and yes i'm not on holiday anymore i am back in london and the reason why i have been absent is that something incredible happened and that little bit of news is that i got a job <laughs> <laughs> but I will explain about it in a later video because that's a later video for another day. But today I am in Islington because tonight is the second yearly event of the Matt & Co comedy show. I've been with my friend last year to its very first event but this year I am going with Jack. We're looking forward to it tonight. Don't know what to expect but we're just gonna have to see how it goes. This is a brand new lineup to what we've had before. Yes, I am just gonna probably have to see how we go really. Well, we've just arrived a little bit early than expected. So me and Jack are gonna have a little bit of a chill before we go in and I may vlog a little bit, I may not, but I don't really know yet for sure. But I will try and give you some footage as much as I possibly can, but it might be that it will just be a short vlog. So, so by the time you will be watching this, you've already been fast forward into the venue so see you in a minute that's the effort okay. yeah i've got the feeling well we're just settling around and look who we bumped into hello there's liam and then there's connor <laughs> so we'll look the very back of it there you go different camera angles I'm just laughing at the height. Just like, just like up so and then down. It's me. I'm like subtle blocking and you're like yeah. <laughs> it's just like I'm gonna be lifted up and I'm gonna be lifted down. <laughs> but oh well, you guys are good. I'm actually, I'm not even in shot. I was just like, yeah, I had a great time. <laughs> <laughs> Hollywood's film director. So, I'll tie it up. Look, like I do. But I'm gonna be just like cringing myself when I'm editing. You'll be like, Sass, no, what are you doing? So, sides. Ow. Look, I get the back. Looks lovely. Thank you. Right, Hi. good morning, guys. That's a little bit of a way to start the vlog. <laughs> but yeah, and Jack's been a very good cameraman despite him being very tired after last night. You feeling okay, darling? I'm all right. You okay? Yeah, I feel all right today. <laughs> My full slip on a train, apart from that. <gasps> and I have to nug at you and like, Oi, Jack, wake up! <laughs> <laughs> or I could take up my perfume like, great, Spanish, you need to wake up. <laughs> right, okay, Dorky. Get the pack up. Right then, Mr. Impatient, are you ready to rock and roll in the mosey? I most certainly am. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess you can see you're recording me for most of the time. <laughs> I don't mind though. He likes to actually record when I'm not looking. <laughs> and I forgot to put my brush in. This is how forgetful I am. So today we are going to go into London and do a bit of shopping. And I don't know what we're going to do. We've been promised ourselves to go into three shops today. 
But yeah, but it might be because yesterday was a little bit of a shorter vlog. But if it might be long, no, not long. Who knows, really? But yesy ho, yesy ho. Why did I say that? <laughs> Silly Billy. Anyway, I've got everything to go. I've got please, money, phone, all set, ready to go. Lego Sherlock Holmes. I know that someone is really Look there. Right, who have we got? Scrooge McDuck, Huey Dewey and Louie, Chip and Dale, uh, Frozen, Edna, Jack and Sally, uh, Mickey and Minnie, Hercules and Hades, Jasmine Jafar and Anna and Elsa. <laughs> Look at who I'm sitting there next to. Ah, <laughs> uh, good old William Shakespeare. What's that good to be at? Ultimate. <laughs> back home where I am. I know I didn't really record a lot today, but because I've been really, really busy, I didn't really get a chance to film. But that's okay though, these things happen. But I thought I would just give you a little bit of a feedback on what's happened, because there are some bits that I did miss out. What happened last night was that, if you've watched my previous video from last year, then you'll know that I went to an event called the Matt and Co Comedy Show. It was in its second year because I I went to its first year last year and let me tell you the second year was absolutely incredible there was a perfect lineup for this year and there was a lot of comedians big names who were really 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 wonderful and they pour their heart and soul into taking their time just to actually do stand-up comedy to raise money for charity and Honestly, they did a really, really good job, but our favourites, well, me and Jack's favourite comedians are Ashley Story, and I don't know if I pronounced her surname right, but I think that's how I pronounce it. Ashley Story, what a legend. She was absolutely comedy gold. She really had the audience going and she really had a lot of lively energy and I have to say that she was one of the best comedians I've watched at the comedy show and then I know I get his name all the time like eh -eh, completely wrong and the person who I'm referred to is Craig Davis or Greg Davis yeah it is Greg Davis actually but you know who I'm talking about <laughs> I always get his name confused all over the place I never even heard of him before but Jack had and I thought to myself what what's gonna happen but apparently he's like one of the big big names in the lineup and what he did was absolutely amazing because last night at the time I'm recording this when he came up on stage he sat down and the very first thing that he did was he opened his little notebook and he said well you have to bear with me because I haven't done stand-up comedy in a year and a half and I don't know what I'm doing so he just said it very naturally very calmly and then all of a sudden he opened his little notebook but it, it's not kind of like his notes notes but it, in an audience point of view it's kind of like a journal and from that journal he tells his stories about his experiences with people and his careers mainly in teaching and how he interacts in day-to-day -day life <laughs> It was really good. I There were so many things that happened, but I cannot really tell them on here because they are all adult humour jokes and I know they're not appropriate for YouTube, but let's just say that he was absolutely really good. And I did have an opportunity just to say hello to Josh and Sav and Liam and Connor before I actually went. And then today... I went shopping in the West End with Jack because we were deciding to get Christmas presents because it's that time of the year again where we have to find Christmas presents. But unfortunately for me, November is pretty, pretty bad because we have a lot of birthdays. By me, we, I mean me and my family. We have a lot of birthdays in November, but we're kind of used to it. But then I'm starting to get into the Christmas present stage 
page. So I'm going to find out and just have a look at what people would want for Christmas. And in the meantime, I'm so happy this came through the post while I was away. I'm going to watch Lion King! Ah! I pre-ordered the DVD since August, so I cannot, cannot wait to watch it. Ever since this came out, I've been so obsessed with The Lion King. Like, more than Tarzan, actually. I just really love The Lion King at the moment, and I want everything to do with The Lion King. But I know I can get a little bit too obsessed, so I'm going to have to control my addiction on The Lion King. But yes, I cannot wait to watch this movie! If I get a chance tonight, I'll just have a sit down and a little bit of a watch while I'll just sort something out for work. And speaking of work, I may have to draw this video to a close because I need to get ready and also I need to prepare some notes before I go into work tomorrow. And again, like I said before in the beginning of the vlog, which was yesterday, I will do a later video at some point on autism and employment. I don't know if I'm actually going to upload it in time for Christmas or just about a few weeks after, but since because my job is really really big right now and I have to work from home I really have to work from home I'm not gonna have much time on YouTube as much as I hoped but unfortunately it is the reality of it because I really want to work in the working world and I love my job I really really love my job but I know I have to make some sacrifices but yes I really hope you enjoyed this little mini vlog of a video it wasn't that perfect of a video but I, I thought it was a really good video to start with and also I haven't unpacked because I need to unpack before I need to do all of it so hence why I'm gonna have to have a dash off in a minute <laughs> if you know what I mean so until then guys I probably will leave you to it because I know I want something more to say but I know I can't because I have to get moving but yes I really hoped you enjoyed this video and if you have seen an event or charity event like this before let me know what event you went to in the comment section down below and let's get talking about it and then also comment down below who is your favorite stand-up comedian i would love to hear your favorite comedians as well because i know for me my favorite is ashley story but there will be other people who have a favorite comedian but yes let me know in the comment section down below and i cannot wait to read them and until then guys i hope you have a wonderful day wherever you are in the world and as always always remember to keep on dreaming and to never stop believing i'll see you very soon bye Bye.